Hi, and welcome to Interactive Tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a slideshow. You can easily edit pictures, text, call to action buttons to create an amazing slideshow for your project. First of all, sign in to your profile on interactive.me to start. To create a slideshow, click Template Gallery button at the top of the screen. Select Slideshow. Select the template you like from the list by clicking the Edit button. The Preview button will allow you to preview the template. I'm going to choose a simple one. Let's click Edit. As most of you know, I really love geography. So today's topic will be World's Best Places to Visit. I click on plus icon above and select Text option. Let's change our text to Top 3 World's Best Places to Visit. I'm gonna change the size of my text as well. Make it bold and move it to the center. Perfect! You can change background color by selecting the main block and choose the color you like. To add your line of images, click on Edit button. In the editor window, you will see images that you need to replace with your own. This template includes 8 pictures which is too much for us. So let's delete some of them by clicking on trash bin icon. Ok, I keep 3 pictures. Click on more text options link if you want to add an additional information about your picture. I feel header with Kyoto and description with Kyoto is the capital city of Kyoto Prefecture in Japan. Good. It's time to change your picture. To do this, click on the camera icon next to your description. There are two ways to upload a new image. Directly from your computer or using the Unsplash library. My library section contains images you previously used in other projects. They can be uploaded from Unsplash or from your computer. To add an image from your device, click Upload Media. Unsplash library is direct access to the Unsplash stock photo service. We are going to use this option. Let's enter a subject into the search. In my case it will be Kyoto. Select the image you like. I love this one. I check this box and click Place Image. It's done. Note that you can use this panel to move your block up and down. Clone it or delete. Let's repeat this step to the next block. I click More Text Options and fill a header with Sydney Opera House and add a description. Then I click on the camera icon, select Unsplash Library and search for Sydney Opera. Pick this beautiful one and click Place Image. And a last one. Header. Description. And a picture. Perfect. I can keep doing it for days, since there is still a lot of beautiful places in the world. 
but our tutorial must be short to save your time. I only wish that you will see even more wonderful places in your life. Let's save our project. Click the preview and evaluate the current state of your slideshow. Try your quiz and don't forget to rate how it looks on different devices. To do this, switch between the phone and personal computer icons. If you notice an error or decide to fix anything, return to the editor by selecting this menu item. Don't forget to select the title for your project. Let's name our quiz as Slideshow. After that, you can safely click the Publish button. Your project is ready. You can share with your audience by sending a link or choosing any other convenient way. Let's view our project. As you can see, our project works perfect. Keep in mind that you can always return to editing your template again by clicking the Edit button in My Projects tab. You can also check statistics by clicking this button. Good luck!